what is going on guys apathy here yes you know me and today we're going to be showing you the best pro player gun in vanguard this class is amazing this gun is incredible ars have nightmares about this freaking gun it is an absolute do-it-all gun and you guys if you don't trust me i even went to a bz stream and got his class set up to show you guys that we're rocking the same thing the only difference was i like the slate reflector he uses the iron sight but I'm going to show, be showing you this class and talk about it and get into some gameplay. Let's do it, baby. All right, guys, enough talking from me. Let's get right into the class setup. So for the muzzle, we got the F8 stabilizer. We have the 317 mm uh, barrel. The first one, we have this iron sight. So there's two iron sights. It's honestly whichever one you prefer. They're both really good. Uh, this one gives you a little bit, I think, uh, aim down sight speed more. It's it's not really a difference. Uh, we got the folding stock. We have the smiley. I like to call it the smiley pistol grip. I don't even know that's how you pronounce it. Um, we got the stipple grip. We have the lengthened for ammo type. We have brace and quick. Now, some of you guys are probably wondering why there's no mag damage round magazines. Well, it's actually not allowed in the CDL. It's going to be banned. So this is the class setup. Now let's get into some gameplay. Show you guys what I can do with this gun and talk a little bit about it. All right, guys, we're blessed today. We got some dome and we got some patrol. Uh, easily the best, in my opinion, the best pub map. Oh, a Beezy's class is freaking fire. That guy just got turned on. This iron sight also feels really nice. I don't know. I like the iron sight. I just got used to the slate. The slate just felt good. But this one's feeling pretty good itself. And you guys know the MP40, especially with damage rounds, is OP. Without damage rounds, it's still freaking good, man. Oh my god, you can see. Uh, it is freaking incredible. I do want to make an MP40 like best class that without damage rounds or with damage rounds, because obviously this gun is just a whole nother level. Um, but even without, it's good to kind of just got it's good to have both, you know. Nice little beams here. Pre fire that door, seven bullets. That's all you need in this game. Yup. That's a GG. Oh, there's another guy here. Thank you for the help, sir. Bro, the spawns are so dumb in this game. The spawns bro. are chaotic, brother. You're playing patrol, brother. Deep breaths. Deep me. breaths. Deep breaths, brother. You're playing patrol, brother. Welcome to patrol, my man. It is chaotic, and you're playing dome. That's a that's a this that's a recipe for craziness. I ran out of ammo, guys, so I'm gonna have to get this gun. So, I don't know if you guys have been watching uh, scrims or any pros playing at the pro level. The MP40 is honestly absolutely destroying the comp right now. It's absolutely demolishing everybody. All the pros are complaining how good the MP40... Or not the pros. The AR players are complaining about the MP40. There's a little jump shot to activate the attack dogs. Let's activate that bad boy. And uh, the MP40 is just so dominant, man. Um, you know, from what I've watched, ARs definitely can hang some certain gunfights. Uh, obviously, you got long-range gunfights, but... Currently, with this hardpoint only mode, uh, you see a lot of three subs in a lot of these maps. You're seeing a lot of chaoticness. You're seeing kind of subs dominate the scene. Fury kill. This gun is beaming. I like it. And I have been playing a lot of search and destroy. You can see you're not missing bullets with this class unless he gets the first shot. MP40 versus MP40. The funny thing is, I'm pretty sure a lot of these MP40s I'm facing do have uh, damage rounds. So that's why certain gunfights here, they're actually kind of shredding me. Um, Bro. Certain gunfights are definitely crazier. I have my dogs. Let me call them in. I haven't called them in yet. But trust me, this gun still goes super, super fast. Uh, like I said, it's AR's worst nightmare. Um, it's actually crazy. I know a lot of you guys seen like there's... It's one or the other. There's Call of Duties where subs right off the bat are pretty OP. Oh my god. Oh, if I would have killed that guy. There's uh there's ARs off the break break, which are very dominant. Usually it's ARs um sometimes. And uh, you know, it's Dude, just you spawn behind me, bro. It's one or the other. It's just one or the other. Um and sometimes you just Damn, that was a nice movement. Island boy. So this game we're blessed with some actually <laughs> OP subs. Um subs just being really dominant. I mean, ironically enough, we say subs are dominant, but ARs with some damage rounds and all those like all those uh, crazy stuff you can put on the guns are actually pretty damn good. And I think that's where they become too overpowered. And basically, their you know pros are like, we got to get these damage rounds out. Like ARs become essentially do it all guns with some of those uh, things allowed. So you can you can sit here and say MP40 is broken, MP40 this, but. I guess in a in a in a standard version of the MP40 versus a, a kind of a standard AR, the MP40 is a lot better. There's some dogs here. It's getting crazy. It's getting crazy here. And crazy. 
Getting crazy. Bloodthirsty. So it is, it is kind of crazy, but... Jesus, this thing beams. Oh, come on. Dog killed me? That's one. Let me kill that guy. That's my bomb run with three-piece. Hit the reload, because I don't know where they're going to be somewhere on me. So you all spawn. Dog, stop attacking me. It turned on. You know what I'm saying? Like, get turned on, dog. A little schmicky. Almost killed myself. I'm just doing my thing, baby. Just doing my thing. Oh, Jesus. He missed. He missed the bite. Thank God. I would have been dead, sir. Oh, I got the little cheeky spots. Watch and learn something. Watch and learn something. Oh, he, oh, dude, I thought he died. I thought he died. Oh, yeah. This gun is just freaking incredible, man. This is not even the gun's full potential. Because if you if you put the damage rounds on this thing, it becomes so freaking good, man. The donk loves it. The donk loves this gun. I mean, it couldn't be... Oh, my God. Like, the fact that I can beam that guy is actually insane. Jesus. MP40 is literally steroids the sub on steroids very good gun but it, it wouldn't be world war ii without them before being op right like or vanguard i guess world war ii error though this guy's going wide left oh no we got coming here oh, this guy's mad I'm juking him what did my streak just saved my life it did and it also didn't kill me that's actually pretty incredible that's pretty lucky so the way this game works i think there's a lot of potential for a lot of guns to be good and viable um the mp40 just has good damage shoots very straight adds good pull out time like basically has everything you want on the sub uh the other subs are really good time to kills are pretty good on the other guns they just lack everything right like they so one of them lacks a little bit uh range one of them has too much recoil one of them if you do put too much recoil it lacks sprint out time or ads time and it's like it just it's just hard to really bounce out those other guns to the point where it's like an mp40 but i think if the mp40 ever got nerfed uh the meta could shift very very quickly very quickly 11 bullets that's all i need baby that's all i need that's all i need baby got a pistol oh my god they're spawning on me attack dogs oh yeah baby Two seconds left. That's a GG. That was the uh, BZ class. It was really good. All right, guys. Thank you for watching the video. As always, I appreciate the love. If you watch this video, especially if you got to here, that means a lot, man. That means you watch pretty much everything. And that support is incredible. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. If you actually enjoy this video, doing these class setups with these guns, and maybe even using certain people's guns, uh, I could definitely do more of these. Just leave it down in the comment below. And don't forget to check me out at twitch.tv slash apathy, where I stream on the daily. We'd love to see more of you guys. And always check out my Apathy Shorts channel. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Apathy, out.